got this. Welcome, Clash Car Crew, to Road to the Show 337. The end of the season is winding down. We are looking at the wild card standings right now. We lead the top spot just by three and a half games over the Rangers. I'm cool if we hold on to that wild card, but I want to go for the division. We are playing the White Sox coming up, and we are only five games back, so this is possible. We have two series left. Our next game is going to be at home against the White Sox, and then we have a four-game series just a week before the season ends in Chicago. We can get the division. Let's go. Who do I want to text angrily? Let's go Kevin Kiermeyer. I forgot he's on the White Sox. Sends me a text acknowledging our recent series loss. <laughs> Guess what, Kevin Kiermeyer? It's just a series. We'll get back on track. <laughs> Your boy's hair is getting long. Jeez. Not as long as Little Kirsch's, though. I know a lot of you in the Super Bowl video were like, what the? Yeah, Little Kirsch grew up. He is maturing. And wow, a solo home run from the White Sox to lead off the game is not what we want. But Dominique Montano, he did get a double. If I can get a hit, drive him in, we'll tie up the game. Like that solo home run never happened. Let's go, Kleshka. Let's get us a tie game. Go through. Go through. Send Montano. Send Montano. They're sending him. Beautiful. Okay. They hit the cut, and they're not going to get me. Woo! We have a tie game. We literally just swapped places. Now I'm on second. He scores. Tie game. Let's keep doing that. I think JD's going to be up next. Yes, he is. JD, just keep doing that. Copy and paste what I just did, okay? Swap places with me. He will swing, and it's a little grounder. It's not going to go. I'm going home. No, skirt, 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 skirt. No skirting could get me away from the catcher that fast. Dang it. Okay, what is it? Kiermaier. All right, I just texted him before the game. He says they got the advantage. He says to not sleep on them. Don't worry. We ain't. He hits it. Oh, come on. Don't get past me. I just got to go back, get the ball, throw it. Got this. Beautiful. What do we got next? Hitting. I would love to get back in the batter's box. Yes. And we're tied again. Okay. So we're tied 1-1 in the first. Now we're tied 3-3 in the third. Freaky. But same position. Man on second. And now we're swinging for that high and outside. Tried to take it that way. Did not work out that way. That's okay. I think that might be Dominique Montano again on second. And now we're going for the high fastball. Still not catching up to it. We got to adjust. We got to be quicker. Unless he throws, what does he have? A changeup or pretty much anything else, honestly. And now, okay, see, he slowed it down. He's trying to trick our brain. But we're not falling for it. We're smarter than that. I passed the 12th grade, okay? I got my diploma. So I, I, I'm a pretty tough cookie, all right? I'm a pretty smart cookie. I also uh, graduated from college, and I've been waiting for my degree for uh, two years now, and it still has not arrived. Pandemic obviously has a lot to do with that, but I'm still waiting for that sucker to get here. And it really, you know, you don't feel like you've completely finished until that is in your hands and i've been waiting for so long i applied to graduate in november 2019 still have not received it let's see what we can do oh he's going for the pickoff oh my oh but the ball's in the dirt the ball's in the dirt and we're gonna be safe yes okay that little mistake might just give us an advantage hopefully it does jd o2 count let's see what happens second and third is a good spot for the rbis and he's gonna poke He's not going to get it deep enough, is he? No. That sucks. We're not even going to get a sack fly on that. I really was hoping he would drive in some runs, but now that duty goes to Brandon Drury. Let's see what he does. One ball, two strikes. Not feeling confident with your 258 average. Uh, he swings, but no sack fly because we have three outs. That is honestly heartbreaking. Because I thought we were going to get something going there. Maybe for the rest of the game. Hey, look at that. We're up by one. Who's to say that drop ball didn't start like a confidence boost for the rest of the team? And now, maybe I just given us a bigger... Nope. Nope. Got to go back to the gym. Start pumping iron because I got warning track power. I got to get it over that center field fence. We're still winning, though. 
And Ozzy Vaccaro, whoever you are, is in the box. Let's see what he does against our funky pitcher right there. That was a weird windup. Uh, I hate when they bunt. Absolutely hate it. Takes me out of the action. Why is it even included? MLB The Show 21, I hope you are better with the animations. I hope there is more action. More story would be great. And now, <laughs> broken bat, and I am sad. But I am happy that we're winning. So it's not completely an L for now. And it is still 5-3. to three. Love that. Matt Chapman on the White Sox. Why? They do. They really got so many good players after I left. This is hit to my right. We're going to turn a double play. Me and I don't know. Lourdes. It's a Lourdes. Double play has been turned. Who else do they have? Wilson Contreras. Kevin Kiermeyer. Shane Bieber. That White Sox team just got so much better after they traded me. And oh, whoa, we uh, broke open. Knocked down the doors. We have a six-run lead. And now to right, it's going to go foul. I was hoping that would stay down the line. They got Jonathan Holder. Who is not going to hold anything right now. This whole team has not been able to hold it together. And I'm going to make it unravel for its final string. <laughs> okay. Uh, oh, if I would have waited a little bit longer. I, I've had a lot of prime spots here. We do have two hits. But I want the big hit. You know, I feel like we haven't gotten that. And now to right. I feel like we got the zone up there in time. But why do I feel like he's going to catch up to it? He's not. Beautiful. I think they're going to send him. I'm going to go for the triple, and I'm going to be safe. It is now 11-3, to three, and I feel like I just got that big hit, baby. All right, my 12th on the season, and JD, you're up next. Two outs, and screw it. Should I just go for a steal of home? I'm going to do it. Let's take a gigantic lead. Like, I mean gigantic. Gigan go, go, go. He swings, and it's going to be in play. I feel like I might have had it, honestly. Might have been a ball in the dirt. Your boy might have been safe, but no. Instead, it is three outs with a victory. Not yet. Oh, we still got to get this out on Daniel Palka. And Roberto Osuna is on our team. I didn't even know that. And they're really, they're going to bunt here in the ninth. Why? Why would you do that? You're down by eight. But Osuna, I know, was almost considered to be on the Angels. But then one of our reporters quickly denied that. Said that was not going to happen. And honestly, thank goodness, because the media surrounding our team is already bad enough, and signing Osuna probably would have made it worse. But you know what was not worse? Picking up this victory against our division rival. Now, four games behind. Let's go play one more. We're starting off batting. You love to see it. And I would also like to say, mo this is most likely going to happen. It could happen this season, but I think it's going to happen in the next season. I am going to hit 500 home runs pretty soon. I think I'm like 25 away. So with two weeks left in the season, I don't think that'll happen. But I should be able to do it in the next season on a new team. And I am very excited about that. I don't know where it's going to be yet. But I do know we are close. And I do know we should be able to choose our team this off season. This might get it. Nope. Never mind, I thought it was going to get us one closer, but I was wrong. Dang it. Okay. Thought I got my hands in. Apparently not. Now, are the White Sox leading? Please tell me. Okay, we're leading. You'd love to see it. But I would also love to see my contribution because I just flew out. So let's add something. Nope. No. Ooh, good eye. Good eye. The 2023 AL MVP trying to go back to back. And now... Let me get right to the bombs. What? I thought I got that change up. I honestly did. I really thought I crushed it, but it barely made it out of the infield. That makes me sad. Okay. Is that Whit Merrifield? Did he leave our team? No. It's not Whit. No. Can't be. I just saw 15 and a man playing second base. Is this Whit Merrifield? I don't think it is. No way. Okay, no. It just happens to have the same number as Whit Merrifield and the same position. But, honestly, I don't know where he is. Because I took his position. So maybe he left and are we going to get this? No, another fly out. Man, they just keep getting underneath these things. And the White Sox are leading 6-2. to two. I just noticed. That is not good. Especially oh, hey, but that is very good. Yes. Jonathan Holder, you're not going to hold this one. And now, man, that should have tied the game. That would have been epic. But we are looking for that big breakout hit. We've popped up every single time. We're trying to get on base. And ball. I ain't swinging at that high junk. 
Even though, I, I'll admit, when I played baseball back in the day, you know, not with Dodger films, this looks like it's hit hard enough. Come on, tie the game. Yes! Kleshka ties it up. All these swings are very important because, like I said, we want the division, okay? We do not want the wild card. What was I saying? My days, back when I played baseball, high pitches were my favorite to swing at, honestly. They just, I mean, they look so juicy. They look so good to hit. And now, oh my God, Mike Zunino, it is 6-6, bases loaded, two outs. Please do not want to be one of the hits that gets by me. Oh, I got this. I got this all day. I'm just going to go for the guaranteed out at first base right there. Got him. Can we go walk it off? Please. Have I ever walked it off with the Royals? I don't think so. Uh, whoa, that guy. He looks like a tough cookie. Phil Quivers. Yeah, I don't think I've ever walked it off with the Royals. I'm pretty sure I have not. So that would be epic to do that. Here we go. Flip it. Turn it. Bare hand play. Finished. Yes. Can I walk it off? Please. Let it be me. A yes. Okay. Here we are. 6-6. Six, six. It has to be... That guy's name. Buck Farmer. And... No! Did I get it? No. No. Just... Oh, man. Just missed it. How far into extras are we going to go? Will I get another opportunity? Please give me another opportunity. It is go. Oh, okay. We're still tied. Let's keep it that way. I hope. I really, really want my first Royals walk off. And the only way that's going to happen is if we keep staying in extras here. Stay down. Stay down. Easy one for the first out. Yes, first out. Beautiful. What's going to happen next? Am I going to get another chance? Or is somebody else going to walk it off? Somebody else walked it off whatever hopefully i will be able to get my first royals walk off before the season ends but right now i want you guys to like the video subscribe if you haven't already oh nice mustache and if you made it to the end of this video i want you to comment royals will take the division i will see you next time i got this